taking a method of preserving food that's been around for 4,000 years and we're making it better. Mount Olive Pickle Company got its start in the 1920s. We pack 135 million jars in our plant a year's time and that it turns into about 13 million cases. Making pickles using salt brine solution or sodium chloride has been around for about 4,000 years. It's a really good, safe, effective way of preserving food. But the salt has issues in terms of how we dispose of it. We have our own wastewater treatment system. We're actually discharging some salt in that. So we're always looking for a better method that's also a little more environmentally friendly. The Agricultural Research Services Laboratory was actually initially opened somewhere around 1937. It's been working with pickled vegetables that whole time. There are no other labs like us in the, in the country. We're the only one that work on, uh, specifically on fermented and acidified vegetables. But the project that we're doing now is to ferment totally without sodium chloride or table salt and replace that with calcium chloride and we found in the laboratory experiments that it seemed to work. Salt that goes into the ground can be a problem if it builds up too high because uh, plants can't grow. Calcium chloride we knew could help the texture of the cucumbers and from an environmental point of view it would be less detrimental for what you did have to put out in waste than sodium chloride would be. Fortunately, he was able to begin to work with Mount Olive Pickle Company and they were willing to help us with doing some further trials at their plant. It's really a revolutionary idea. We've used calcium chloride for years as a firming agent in our products, but what's new is the idea of taking it and using it as a way to preserve food. The taste is going to be relatively the same. Those of us who taste them all the time think that it is a better, cleaner flavor. With the product that we have fermented with the calcium chloride technology, we've put out about 213,000 cases, and as of yet, we've not noticed that any of the consumers have come back and said that they've tasted anything different. This is new technology. There's still a lot of variables, there's still a lot of uncertainty about certain things that could happen that we've not experienced yet. And so we want to make sure before we go out there and commit our whole tank yard that everything is going to turn out the way that it should. And although it's very promising and very encouraging, we still got to make sure that we produce a good quality product that is safe for consumers. And that is what my Pickle Company is going to do.